This year's fishing opener is less than two weeks away, but the fish team at the Wisconsin DNR, they're already out on the lake netting fish and testing populations. NBC 15's Hannah Flood was out on Lake Monona with the team today. Hannah, what are these fish scientists out there looking for? John, the team at the DNR tells me you can actually tell a lot about an ecosystem by looking at how fish survive in a lake. Since the DNR stocks all of the muckies in Lake Monona, they test the fish population there biannually every five years. Today, they showed me how they're using microchip technology to follow these fish throughout their lifetime and explain why a healthy muskie can mean a healthier Madison. I think the lakes help define what Madison is as a city. A small investment in taking care of them is a good thing. David Rowe, the fish team supervisor for the Wisconsin DNR, has a love for the lake and the creatures that live in it. Nice smallmouth bass, nice walleye there. That's why him and his team are out here today. Ah, it's a joy for a fisheries biologist. While it's still too early to cast a line on a Wisconsin lake, it's musky spawning season, the perfect time to net the fish and check on their health. And part of what we're doing today is just keeping track on how they're surviving, how many fish are in the lake, how fast they grow. To do that, they're trying to insert small microchips in as many muskies as possible. They're the same technology that people put in their dogs and their cats to identify their dogs and their cats. Once the team catches a muskie in these nets, they're measured. Oh, it counts, 32 inches. Weighed, and if they don't already have one, are inserted with a chip. They want to make sure the lake can support big muskies for two big reasons. And the fish are an indicator of the lake health, but it is really just to make sure that there's fish in the lake because fishing is such a huge industry in the state of Wisconsin. Muskies as a fish that anglers want to catch big trophy muskies, we want to make sure they're growing fast. And it looks like they are. Uh, 46 nine. Which tells the fish team that they must be doing something right. That's what our job at the DNR is to do is make sure that resource is there for people to enjoy and use. In Madison, Hannah Flood, NBC 15 News. The fish sampling happens during this two week spawning period. The team will net about 100 muskies. They rotate surveying different lakes in Madison. And John, they're out there today, but we can't be out there for another about two weeks. Fishing right. opener is May 7th. I have a feeling you're going to be on Lake Monona because you fish. Well, I know so, they're there now. So. Yeah, so you were pretty impressed with that last muskie. I was, yes. That, that, I'm, I'm going after it. <laughs> all right, that fish better watch out out there. Well, it's a great day to be out there. Interesting story. Thanks Thank a lot, you. Hannah.